Did you know the Olympic flame has never been extinguished since its modern inception in 1928? That's right, it's been burning continuously for nearly a century. The Olympic flame, a symbol that captures the world's attention every four years, has a journey as fascinating as the games themselves. This flame, ignited under the Grecian sun, travels thousands of miles, passing through various lands and hands until it reaches the host city. Its journey is a testament to the unbroken spirit of the Olympics, a flame that never goes out, no matter what. But why does this flame start in Greece, you may wonder? It all traces back to the ancient Olympic Games, held in Olympia from 776 BC through 393 AD. However, the use of this symbolic torch wasn't introduced until the modern Olympics began in Athens in 1896. The inaugural relay took place in 1936 ahead of the Berlin Olympics, marking the start of a tradition that has continued to this day. And here we are, on the cusp of the Games of the 33rd Olympiad, Paris 2024. The flame for these games has already been lit in a ceremonial event, and soon it will begin its unusual journey from Athens, Greece, to Paris, France. The flame will spend a night at the ancient Acropolis in Athens before its handover to the Paris 2024 organizers. The Olympic flame is more than just a beacon of light. It is a symbol of unity, hope, and the indomitable spirit of mankind. It is a reminder of the ancient games and the ideals they stood for. It is a link that connects us to our past, our present, and our future. But how did this tradition start, and why is it so important? Why does the flame always come from Greece? What is the significance of the city it starts from? And what does the flame symbolize in the context of the modern Olympics? These questions are as intriguing as the journey of the flame itself. So how did this tradition start, and why is it so important? Let's delve into the past to find out. The Olympic flame harks back to the ancient Greeks, who valued fire as a divine element. It's fascinating to think that the flame we see today at the Olympic Games carries with it a legacy that stretches back over two and a half millennia. In ancient Greece, fire was seen as a gift from the gods, specifically Prometheus, who defied the gods by stealing fire from Mount Olympus and giving it to humanity. This act of rebellion was celebrated at many Greek festivals, including the Olympic Games held in Olympia, which began in 776 BC and continued until 393 AD throughout the Games, symbolizing the endurance, hope, and the struggle for victory that lay at the heart of the Games. It's important to note, however, that unlike the multinational relay we see today, the ancient Greeks did not have an Olympic torch relay. The flame was kept within the confines of Olympia, illuminating the games but not traveling beyond its boundaries. In the context of the Olympic Games, the flame served a dual purpose. On one hand, it was a religious offering to the gods, a tangible symbol of humanity's gratitude for the divine gift of fire. On the other, it was a beacon of unity, a light that brought together individuals from different city-states in a peaceful competition, creating a sense of shared identity and mutual respect. With the end of the ancient Olympic Games, the tradition of the flame was buried in the sands of time, only to be rekindled centuries later. But that's a story for the next scene. Stay tuned as we delve into the modern revival of the Olympic flame and its journey from the ruins of Olympia to the heart of the global sporting stage. Fast forward to the 20th century, the Olympic flame was reintroduced, but not without its twists and turns. The Olympic Games had found their footing again, and with the new era came the resurgence of old traditions. The 1928 Amsterdam Olympics was a pivotal moment in this journey, but it wasn't the athletes or the sports that made it so. Instead, it was a single blazing flame, the Olympic flame, a symbol borrowed from the ancient Greeks and given a modern twist. This was the first time in the modern Olympics that the flame was lit and kept burning throughout the games. However, the flame was not enough. The organizers of the Berlin Olympics in 1936 sought to connect the ancient and modern games more explicitly. And so, the Olympic torch relay was born. The torch would be lit in Olympia, Greece, and carried all the way to the Olympic Stadium in Berlin. This relay was more than a physical journey. It was a symbolic one, connecting the origins of the Olympic Games in ancient Greece with their modern revival. But this new tradition was not without its controversies. The 1936 Berlin Olympics was infamous, remembered more for its political undertones than its sporting achievements. The torch relay too was seen by many as a propaganda tool, an attempt to link the Nazi regime to the glory of ancient Greece. 
Yet, despite these contentious beginnings, the Olympic flame and the torch relay endured. They became a staple of the Olympic Games, a symbol of the connection between the ancient and modern world, between sport and culture. The flame has since journeyed across continents and oceans, carried by athletes and ordinary people alike, each step a testament to the enduring spirit of the Olympics. And so, from the ruins of Olympia to the bustling cities of the 20th century, the flame has traveled, casting its warm glow on the faces of millions. Despite its controversial beginnings, the Olympic flame has become a symbol of unity and the Olympic spirit. Ever wonder why the Olympic flame is always lit in Greece? This tradition finds its roots in the ancient Olympic Games, held in Olympia, Greece from 776 BC through 393 AD. The flame symbolized Prometheus stealing fire from the Greek god Zeus, a nod to the defiance and audacity inherent in the human spirit, a spirit that the Olympics seeks to celebrate. Fast forward to the modern era, the first symbolic torch made its appearance at the 1928 Amsterdam Olympics, and the inaugural relay took place in 1936, ahead of the Berlin Olympics. But why Greece, you may ask? Well, it's a tribute to the birthplace of the Olympic Games, a nod to the ancient traditions that form the foundation of this global spectacle. The flame is lit in a ceremony in Olympia, a city in southern Greece. Here, in the ruins of the Temple of Hera, the flame is ignited using a parabolic mirror to focus the rays of the sun, a method that stays true to ancient techniques. The lighting ceremony is usually attended by the president of the International Olympic Committee, signifying the unity and shared history of the Games. Once lit, the flame embarks on a journey that is as symbolic as it is physical. The flame travels across Greece for about a week, a journey that culminates in Athens. In 2024, for instance, the flame that will burn at the Summer Olympics in Paris spent the night at the ancient Acropolis in Athens, a week before its handover to the Paris Toll. As we anticipate the 2024 Paris Olympics, the flame's journey takes on a new significance. This year, the flame will make its way through the hands of countless torchbearers, tracing a path from the ancient city of Athens, Greece, to Paris the heart of France and the bustling epicenter of the games of the 33rd Olympiad. This journey, steeped in tradition and steeped in symbolism, will culminate in the Olympic flame lighting ceremony. The flame ignited in the city of Olympia, Greece, will be handed over to the Paris 2024 organizers, marking the official commencement of the games. This ceremony is more than mere spectacle. It's a symbolic gesture that speaks to the unity and shared spirit of competition that defines the Olympic Games. The 2024 Summer Olympics, known as Paris 2024, will be an international sporting event that will run from the 26th of July to the 11th of August. The Games will take place across Paris and 16 cities in metropolitan France, extending even to the French colony of Tahiti. The Flames' journey, from the ancient Acropolis in Athens to the modern cityscape of Paris, serves as a bridge between the past and the present, between the ancient world and our modern global community. It's a testament to the enduring legacy of the Olympic Games, a tradition that dates back to se As we look ahead to the 2024 Paris Olympics, the flame's journey takes on a new significance. It's a symbol of our shared humanity, a beacon that illuminates our collective aspirations and our pursuit of excellence. It's a reminder that, Despite our differences, we are united in our love for sport and our shared commitment to fair play and mutual respect. As the flame lights up the city of Paris, it will once again remind us of our shared humanity and the power of unity. More than just a tradition, the Olympic flame carries a profound meaning. The Olympic flame, a radiant symbol that travels across continents, is more than a mere prelude to the Games. It is a beacon of unity, peace, and the indomitable Olympic spirit. The journey of the flame from the ancient city of Olympia to the host city, culminating in the lighting of the Olympic cauldron, is a powerful narrative that transcends sports. The flame is a symbol of continuity, a link between the ancient and modern games. It's a nod to the ancient Greeks who held the first Olympic Games in Olympia in 776 BC and a testament to the modern revival that started in Athens in 1896. This fiery symbol is a tangible connection to thousands of years of history. But the flame is not merely a tribute to the past. It is a universal symbol of unity, bringing together athletes and spectators from all corners of the globe. The flame's journey across countries and continents is a testament to the global unity that the Olympics inspire. It's a reminder that despite our many differences, 
We are all part of the same human race, striving for excellence in our own unique ways. The flame also embodies the Olympic spirit, a spirit of striving, of reaching for the stars, of pushing the boundaries of what is possible. Each athlete in their pursuit of gold embodies this spirit, and the flame is a constant reminder of their shared ambition and determination. And let's not forget, the flame is a symbol of peace. The games are a time when global conflicts are set aside and the world comes together to celebrate human achievement. The flame, in its serene and steady burn, is a beacon of hope for a peaceful world. As the flame continues to burn, it lights up not just the Olympic Stadium, but also the hearts of millions around the world. It represents the best of us, our unity, our spirit, our ambition, and our hopes for a peaceful world. As we look forward, the Olympic Flame's journey is a testament to our shared history and aspirations. The Flame ignited airing hearts across the globe. As we anticipate the flame lighting ceremony for the Summer Olympics in Paris 2024, we are reminded of this enduring symbol's rich history. From the ancient games held in Olympia from 776 BC to the modern revival in Athens in 1896, the flame has always been a beacon of shared dreams and hopes. The Olympic flame, in essence, is a bridge between our past, present, and future. Keep the flame of knowledge burning. Share this video with your friends, subscribe to our channel for more captivating documentaries, and don't forget to check out our other videos on the fascinating facets of human history.